A vigil is held tonight in Drake Park for the two victims killed in last night's shooting. Good evening, I'm Kathy Marshall, in tonight for Lee. More than 100 community members showed up in honor of the victims killed in the Safeway shooting on the east side of Bend. Several speakers shared sentiments of unity and encouragement at the vigil, remembering 84-year-old Glenn Bennett and 66-year-old Donald Surrett Jr. Speakers also called to the community to refuse allowing senseless deaths to become commonplace. The community also shared in a moment of silence for the lost lives and a choir sang in their honor. I'm only gonna ask one thing of you. One action item I know you're not supposed to ask, but it is near and dear to my heart, and that is that I ask us tonight to refuse to believe that this must be normal. I'm still feeling anger. I'm so angry that this continues. A tragedy like this can make us feel confused and alone and scared and shut down. This is not inevitable. This type of violence is preventable. A GoFundMe page is set up for Glenn Bennett's funeral expenses as well as living expenses to support his sister. You can also donate to the GoFundMe page for Donald Surrett Jr. to help cover funeral expenses and living costs for his wife. You can find both links in the web version of this story at ktvz.com later tonight.